Welcome to the Adventures in Alchemy podcast, where we share tips, techniques, and true stories to support you in using the law of attraction and alchemy to create magic and live the life of your dreams. Here's your host, the founder of DailyAlchemy.com, Michelle Martin Dobbins. Hi, this is Michelle Martin Dobbins, and this is the Adventures in Alchemy podcast. And today I want to talk to you about um, a story that happened to me today. My um, youngest daughter texted me this morning and she said, why do we have Fruit Loops? That was her text. And to give you a little bit of context, we have been cutting back on our sugar in our house. Um, I felt like we had gotten a little bit too far with it. And so we, we really cut back for a while. And though I'm still a big believer in moderation in all things, and we eat lots of fruits and vegetables and healthy food and grains and all that. So I was at the grocery store yesterday, and I know they love to have sugary cereals as a treat now and then. And so um, Fruity Pebbles were on sale, and I bought a box and put them up. But they're not used to having those very often. (laughs) And and so my daughter opened the cabinet today, and she's like... "Ah." oh my goodness, why do we have Fruity Pebbles? And I know she was happy to have them. But the funny thing was, is she texted me and said, why do we have Fruity Pebbles? Which made me think. Um, a lot of times when we get something we want in our life and something that we've been working on manifesting, we have to question it. Like, what did I do to deserve this? Is this is this real? Can I have it? You know, that because she saw the Fruity Pebbles and she's like, can I actually eat these? Am I allowed? You know, and so sometimes we've been waiting, we've been visualizing something, we've been taking inspired action, it's been on our pray, you know, primary journal, or it's been on our dream board, and it comes, yay! But instead of being like, yay, and really, really experiencing the joy of getting what we wanted, we're like, wait a minute, is this for real? Did I really bring this into my life? And Yes, you did. (laughs) Yes, you did. When you have good things, savor them, soak them up, enjoy it. Um, And some of us have these old stories of you can't get too much good. So then you worry if something good happens, when is it going to crash? When is it going to go away? Try to, and try is not necessarily a good word, but really savor what comes. Enjoy the good. Um, You deserve it. You created it. You brought it into your life. So soak it up, enjoy it. Don't necessarily ask why. Now, if you want to, you know, kind of say, hmm, what was I doing that brought this into my life? Maybe I was relaxing. Maybe I was enjoying things. Maybe I took inspired action. That's fine. But don't question whether or not you deserve it. And certainly don't lose any of the joy of experiencing it. Um, Life is here to give us pleasure and bring us joy. And when good things come along, celebrate it. Celebrate it for all it's worth and really soak it up. Because not only are you going to be happy and joyful in that moment, you're going to be creating more joyful, happy moments. Um, The universe says, oh, we gave you fruity pebbles and you loved them. So guess what? More are on the way. So um, enjoy your fruity pebbles or whatever... um, lovely things you have manifested in your life. You deserve them. They're there for you. And that is all for today. Uh, I hope that you have a very magical day and that you go out and manifest something that you love and desire. And if you get a chance to stop by iTunes or Stitcher and leave me a review or rating, I would love that. Or go to my Facebook page and ask any questions or give me ideas for future topics. My Facebook page is facebook.com forward slash Michelle Dobbins author. So have a wonderful day. Namaste. Thanks for listening to the Adventures in Alchemy podcast. Connect with me on thedailyalchemy.com or Facebook at facebook.com slash Michelle Dobbins author. Join us next time for even more magical life tips.